Hello everyone, it's me Shopper. Welcome to another Dragon Hair Selling Goals video. Today's video we have another hero to explain and so hero of the day is really a great one, especially if you focus on, on one single target. She's from the epic because we already done with the rare heroes and we're gonna start it with extremely high rank epic hero and Today's hero going to be the Yuri Guardian. But first, if it's your first time to my channel, don't forget to be hitting the subscribe button and like the video so we help other people to be understanding that hero. Okay, so we're gonna take her skills first. After that, it will be which artifacts for her and which hero to combine her with to get extremely the best out of her. So for her skills, we have the Flame lining, uh, Lineage, and that's her passive. It gives her 20% crit rate, as well as if combining her with uh, a Wild Hero, which is into the Fire Element Steel, uh, she will be getting 5% crit damage, and this crit damage is stackable up to 20 times. And... I don't really think it's possible to be removing it if your enemy having a buff removal it won't work so she's really crazy hero to be using i would say she's supposed to be a legendary instead of an epic because i don't really think any of the legendary heroes having that kind of effect so she's really insane and not only that but Right now I'm using uh, the Rage Gears, and that one is giving her a total of 30% of attack, which making her extremely crazy damage dealer. So for her second skill, or the battle skill, uh, that one, it she's hitting with her blades two times, dealing a total of, uh, well, she's using a fire damage, so first she will be dealing the fire damage up to three times and not only that but also something the game have added which is really great especially when trying to find out how much percentage you get or that skill dealing if you press on the details here you will be seeing exactly how much percentage of the element fire damage it will be causing and here it says it's 90 percent of the hero attack which is extremely great addition to the game and of course the damage caused by that skill it's raising according to the level of the hero itself uh, the last one which is her ultimate it's focusing on just one target and it will be giving her 20 percent attack up for 10 seconds and it will deal a total of 160 percent attack with a fire damage element to the target for a total of five times you can see as well in here if there is uh, another heroes with her or if she itself caused the wild it will be given her more attack so it's really great okay for the gears i have picked the rage later on when having the purple or legendary gears it just try to focus on getting more attack or damage or crit damage so yeah we're trying to give her all the damage possible now we're going to check her uh, the artifacts i have picked for her which focusing completely on to her damage if we check the rare we have the dancing the dancing zero this one to be given her attack speed or the volcanic desk and that one to give damage bonus as well if we go to the epic from here we have the eyeball of the giant to give her damage bonus as well as we can use the this one here the crown of the unclean to be inflicting defense penalty to the hero you can also use uh there is one here i don't really remember which one I'm trying to find. Well, there is here damage bonus too. Mm, mirror? No. Yep, it's that one here. The spiritual and 
Uh, this one here, it will be helping to get her ultimate energy increased after she cost her ultimate. So that's really good addition to her, especially if wanting to be using her ultimate quicker. From the legendary, we have the ring of the Scarlet Sorcerer. That one to be helping to get more damage, especially since she's a wild effect. And also we have the Berserk Mask to be given more time to be causing her skills. There is also this one over here to be helping to get her ultimate quicker too. From the exclusive we can't really pick any because they are exclusive for just specific heroes. You can't use them only in these heroes. For the heroes to be using along with her, we're going to go to the gallery and then here it just to be picking up these ones. And as I said, she's count as a legendary even greater than the legendary. So if you want, you can really use her for the longer term. She will be great addition to your team. You can use also uh, this one here, the Crimson Iris, the Flora. She's really a good addition to go along with her too. But yeah, you can, if you want, you can use all these four later on if you're lucky to get all of them. But of course, it's all depends on what you want from your team. So yeah, that was it for today's video. Write to me in the comment section what or which hero you want to see in the future. I'll make sure to be adding it into the list. So I'll see you all in the next one. Till then, stay safe, take care of yourself.